All right, next for this Mazda CX-5, we're gonna change the front brakes. We use these Duralast, got these from AutoZone, no, yeah, AutoZone. And replace out the brake pad pads. All right, let's go. All right, we're here at the front brake, and we got two bolts we gotta release or loosen. One right here, nine sixteenths. And another down here at the bottom. Uh, yeah, right here at the bottom. So two. And we break those loose. All right. Shout out to my mama. She just called. That's what. Well, y'all don't know how long I've been paused, but you know. So loosen the first one. to the top so now I'm gonna move the camera around and we'll get a better angle. so all right so now we just remove the caliper and to be honest flip it up and off I didn't ask you you got your parking brake set no. Okay. All right. And you don't want to let this hang by the cable either because that will destroy your brake. So let's set it up there. And we're going to take our trusty C clamp. Inspect your holes, no cracks or crevices or nothing. So now we're down here to the brake pads, and actually these pads look pretty good. Your car, you, you've been stopping pretty good, huh? Yes. Yeah. So when you do the brake job? I don't know. Oh. I stop every time. <clears throat> so we we'll pop that one off in the back. Oh, well, like I said, take one off at a time. Your indicator, we'll pop that off and we'll put it on here. You want to make sure it's the same one, but you can see it's not, it's worn out a little bit. We can change it since we put it, since we're here. And put your indicator back on. In the old days when you used to get down to that indicator. All right. All right, you want to put some brake lubricant on the backs of your pads and your hardware before you uh, put them on the car. And pop out the other one. That's the old one. Keep it in hand because you want to put up oh, just like this. Make sure you got another front, the perfect one. Same thing. Raise it up. So, one more thing to do since we're gonna keep the same keep the same shims and everything, we're gonna clean those up also. Use some brake cleaner for that. in your garage on the floor. Oops. Uh, 
I'm gonna get in trouble for that. Let's see. Put that down. The pad with the indicator goes on the back. There you go. You should just be able to snap it in like so. Easy. Place that one in the bottom and hold it. All right, so now we're on the Mazda CX-5, we're gonna change the front brake. So this is the 9 16ths, and this is the bolt. Let's take out the bottom one. Leave the top in. There it goes for later. All right. So now. All right, Daddy, we are good to go. Mazda CX-5 front brake job, all complete. Put a tire on, and let's take it for a ride. 